Tell me, yeah, yeah. Tell me, yeah, yeah. Tell me, yeah, yeah. Tell me, yeah, yeah. Survivors, it's your girl Marika here, and today, 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 my darlings, we are back with another video. If you are a little subscriber and you're still here, thank you so much for being here. And yeah, just sticking with your girl, it's greatly appreciated. I love you, love you, love you so much, so much, so much. And if you are new to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit that notification button so you won't miss anything from your girl. It's greatly appreciated. If you can smash that like button too, let's get into this video. So, a couple of weeks ago, I went to the Birmingham wedding show because as you guys all know I am getting married next year so I've gone down there to get some tips I went with my mother-in-law and we had an amazing amazing time it was lovely I've never been to any of those things before so it was just an eye-opener you know you had live bands there you had people from all over the country and the world just showcasing what they can do for you and make your day super special and super nice so while I was there I bought into a makeup company called Helen a lot of the places that were there were on discount me and my mother-in-law bumped into a makeup company called Helen and they were basically showing us what they had on store we didn't go through all of their products but there was a really really nice sales lady and for the life of me I am sorry honey I cannot remember your name but she basically showed us this packet and in this packet I'll show you what we got and she also showed us the catwalk collection packet which was this normally the price of this hold on hold on let me remember i think the price of this is normally 50 or 55 pound along them lines there you get a foundation you get a concealer you get a double wear effective mascara you get a gloss balm and you also get a shimmer eye powder it says high powder but to be fair when i used it you can use this for a highlighter think of it like a body dust for your whole entire body so that's what i basically will be using it for so basically it sets you back like 50 57 pound or something along them lines but on the day they're selling this for 15 pound i believe so you as i said you get all those stuff in the box and this is what it looks like when you open it that the foundation is missing because they had to go and get another foundation for my skin tone the one that normally comes in here is very she goes it's it's, it's basically white as white it's white as white as white is how she described it to us so she went and got two other colors this one is in nubian nubian darling nubian queen it's in nubian and it's shade free as i said you know that when you're out there certain colors can seem darker or not but that is basically what it looks like i'm going to showcase all of these products for you right now so to see if I've got the right shade as well and I've never even knew there was a Helen E cosmetic the thing that sold it for us the most in this was the shimmer dust the shimmer dust was just exquisite and the pigmentation honey bunnies the pigmentation was just over this world I also went and bought this this hair sets you back 51 pound but we've got it for a tenner and you know the, the discounts on the day even everybody the discounts Counts everywhere like the cake the cake ladies or the the holidays the discounts or the photography or the shoes like or the jewelry everybody had some sort of discount on the day of the Birmingham wedding show it was holidays abroad so there was a lot of people from you know Greece and Spain and Barbados and stuff like that showing you how they can basically plan your day and how your day can be magical with them so it was such a very good atmosphere you had catwalks and stuff like that it was so so much fun and i'm not a girly girl like that so that was my first experience and it was just an amazing one my mother-in-law soon to be so it was just really really nice so in the i1 let me just show let me just show you what it looks like in the in the front so this is it as you can see there it's 51 pound but on the day as i said there were so many discounts and it was just fabulous honey in this kit you get three eyeshadows one two three and then also which i found super cute is the thing that actually protects the eyeshadow is also the applicator as well so i it's been a long time since I've actually used this type of applicator to actually apply my makeup so I probably won't be using the brush only because 
yeah I, I i like my own brushes i like my morphe brushes so i'll probably be using morphe brushes to show you guys what that is like but again if you're just on the go and you want this in your your purse or whatever in your makeup kit you don't really need to be fooling around with brushes if you don't already have a favorite brush you can obviously applicate this okay so it comes with that it also comes with a pot of glitter and it looks like this can you see that it looks like that that is the glitter honey also comes with a very fine brush i'm not sure if you can see that yeah, it comes with a very fine brush for precision very thin for detail also get the fixing gel and it looks like this and that's a, that's that's a lot considering that is a lot you do get a lot in there so you get the free eyeshadows you get the brush and you also get the gel you get the glitter so i'm going to be showing you that and i will obviously be showing you this as well so with this i'm going to be using the foundation in nubian free i'll be using the eyeliner mascara the lip liner the lip gloss and obviously i'll be using the concealer as well so the concealer looks like this you get a lot so you definitely would have to use it with a brush so let's see i'm going to be testing out these products and i'll obviously be giving you a review at the end let's get cracker lacking okay so first of all i'm going to move this to my hairline because honey we don't want to get i don't really mind getting these messy to be fair because i've got so many i've got like over 100 headbands i just went crazy one day i saw them i thought oh. And yeah, so first of all, first of all, first of all, you know me, honeys, I have so many primers, but again, I always go back to the best, in my opinion anyway. It's one of the best that I have. This one, and I do like the Fenty Beauty one, but to be fair, I find this one way better than that. So I'm going to prep and prime my face. So when you open it, there's a little little sleeve that you just got to peel off, like so. So this is like a mousse foundation, I would say. So it says stage matte mousse. It's a great matte foundation coverage, long lasting finish, perfect for normal to oily skin types, covers imperfection, stays comfortable and shine free throughout the day. So let's see if that is correct, honey. It's gonna be using my primer. It's a foundation on this side to mix it and it's also a concealer brush on the other side. I'm going to be using this brush to apply and then I'll be using sponge to blend it out. Okay. So very, very shiny. Took me a while to blend in, but once it was blended, it was okay. I think it's a little bit darker than I'm used to, but not that much. Do you know what I mean? It's not like, oh my god, that's super dark. It's it's not so bad. I do feel very brown and golden though. So, but yeah, let's see, let's see. So that was the Nubian Free Helen E Mousse Foundation. Not necessarily just pump and go. They have a concealer and let's see what that's saying. So I'm gonna use the other end of my Primark foundation brush, which is the concealer side. So this is what it looks like, it's, it's mousse as well. You hope for change, hope for change. Hope we don't stay the same. Hope we can rearrange, remake what we made, retake and relay, relay and pave away, pave a lane and change a game, change our name frame to frame. That we lay underlay, underlay. You alley 26 26. So this one says it's highly effective concealer, formulated to give excellent coverage, minimize blemishes, and correct dark marks light and shadows and improve imperfections apply and blend with the helen e pressure concealer brush or your fingertip after you have applied your chosen base my base is their foundation so i'm gonna go back and use my blender to see if i can blend this up okay 
pleasantly surprised because when I first opened the pot and I tried to get some on the concealer brush, it was quite thick. It was quite thick, so to me it was like, okay, maybe it's not gonna go on as nice or whatever, but it was very easy to blend, very easy to blend out. And I like the little shine. Again, it's still very shiny, very, it makes your skin feel and look very hydrated, not oily, just a nice little shine to it. I don't really like a mousse base products. So I kind of like the lotion-y type of thing, you know, like the concealer that you can pour out or the foundation that you can just pump out. That's that's, that's for me that's cool do you know what I mean I like that it's easy it's quick whereas you gotta really work in with the mousses and the very moussey type of concealers but I'm pleasantly surprised I would actually take the time to do this because it actually does look it looks decent all together I'm just gonna go and use my Morphe R7 with some powder I want to see how this sets on top of the concealer so I'm gonna use my other products I'm gonna be using the Technics soft focus for my setting powder and just basically see how these products work with my other everyday products so if i'm blinking a lot i've got a very bad eye at the moment i don't know what's going on with it but it's very blurry and fuzzy so i might need to just wash it out with something in a minute i'm then going to use my morphe e52 brush and i'm going to use my raw cosmetic connection bronzer i'm just gonna bronze. There you go. I think it's working very well so far, so good. I'm gonna use my Made Brush 874, and that's just to brush off the excess powder. So back onto the shimmer, 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 shimmer. I absolutely love this shimmer, and hopefully you guys will too. I'm going to just lightly put a little, see look a teeny bit. I literally just dabbed it, honey, and I'm just gonna. Mhm. Mm so this is the shimmer pot and then i'm gonna go in with my normal shimmer which is techniques get gorgeous highlighting powder yeah it doesn't have a name it's just it's, it's just the best though i use this for all my like my nose my top lip and then i do my eyebrows once i put some definition in them honey so far i'm really enjoying myself these products are very good easy to use not complicated at all let's continue and see what else we can do i'm going to now go on to my eyes there's no instructions here so it basically just says Contains intense eyeshadow times three rolls gold glitter, pro eye and lip liner brush, and a fixing gel. So I think they give you the, the pro eye and lip liner brush just so that you can get sharp definition on the eyes. Put some concealer on my eyes. This way, have I gone gonna straight? Lost my morals and my way. Is this what love takes? Truly, truly, truly die, but I'm lost in my doubt will they go into my kit collection let's see right now that i have prepped my eyes i'm going to use my common sense here and see which one goes first i'm going to use my morphe e10 brush like this and i'm going to use the darkest color Big, big, big shit one at a time. Spliff got burn. Gonna use my Morphe M433 to just buff out the edges. And then I'm gonna go in with a lighter colour on my outer lid. I'm gonna go with my Morphe M506 brush like this and I'm gonna go with the lighter color and just do the corners
Then I'm gonna go on with the gel and then I'm gonna put on the glitter. I'm gonna use their brush to pack on the glitter. Catching speed is like a cold. You're the one I wanna hold. First place got the gold. You really bred the mold. This ain't a common cold. This ain't jungle fever. This is feelings getting deeper. This is feelings through the speaker. I'm the healer and the ether. You don't care, me neither. All I know is you're a keeper. We can balance like a Libra. We can branch out like a tree dust. High off the reefer, reefer. Chiba, chiba, like a chief dust. I, I think it's quite cute. A lot of glitter in it. And the look that you create is, is rather, it's, it's nice. Let's see what else we can do with the rest of the products that we got. Okay, so I'm going to move on to the Bubble Wear Mascara to finish off the eyes. And I'm going to use their eyeliner. Ooh, very, very pigmented. I like it. Mm -hmm. Contemplating should I smudge it or not? I'm not sure yet. This says it's double. Let's see why. But for the eyeliner, I just used it says soft black eyeliner 1.5 gram soft on black pencil liner line and define with ease smooth matte finish they are correct they are right i love that i'm just about to use a double effect mascara two times 4.5 mils two unique brush designs to build and shape lashes coat even the shortest lashes with the define brush I curl and lengthen with the volume brush for extra wow one says volume one says define so I'm going to go with the volume This is what the volume brush looks like It's quite wide for a mascara brush Quite long, sorry, let's see 10 out of 10 for the mascara The mascara is popping I like that We have the waterproof protective lip liner 1.5 grams it says line and define for a fuller lip look holds lip color in place for longer matte soft finish so let's go and try that out here is a lip liner i'm going to now apply it to my lips mm. Catching speed is like a cold. You're the one I wanna hold. First place got the gold. You really break the mold. This ain't a common cold. So it took a while to get on. It's very it's a very light pinky kind of colour. And you know, I've got black lips, so I had to keep on going over and over and over again. But yeah, it went on quite easy. And yeah, it went on easy. Not a fan, not too much of a fan, but let's see. What also comes in it is this little baby hair, and this is is the Helen E Gloss Balm, a dreamy strawberry flavored treat for your lips. Moisturizing and glossy, easy to use applicator. So this is what I'm gonna be using with the lip liner. Let's see what it looks like. It smells good, it smells very good. I wouldn't say strawberry though, but it smells good. So, nothing fantastic, just, just a lip gloss really, uh, it did make the lip liner come out more, it made it pop a little bit more, obviously you'll mix it together, wouldn't have got my way to obviously wear it all the time, but I will now use my setting spray and then give you my review y'all. <laughs> Actually, the lip balm looks a lot better now that I put the setting spray on. <laughs> if my setting spray was Morphe, continue setting mist. I love it. Actually, I better go back to the star. It's a little bit light. So altogether, this is what it looks like. So, does Helen E Cosmetics get to go in with Rico's bag of makeup? Yes, it does. I 
loved everything that I tested. I'm not too keen on the lip balm, but once I put the setting spray on, more moisturized than it did. It was very sticky and tacky when I first put it on. I don't feel that way now. I don't know if it's because the setting spray is mixed up with it or what the reason is, but it looks a lot better than it did when I first put it on. Maybe it needs time to soak into the lips. I don't know, I'm trying to marry you now. But it looks a lot, 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 lot better. I am feeling the foundation. If it's for a quick thing, I must admit I'm not lazy, but getting ready and putting on makeup anyway. We, girls, you already know it takes long if you want perfection. Do you know what I'm saying? So with the mousses and stuff, mixing it, getting the right stuff on the brush, and the, it's work. So if I had a lot of time on my hands, I would just just use this because it, it looks good. I'm loving the shine. I love the fact that it makes my skin look very, very hydrated. It doesn't look greasy. It just looks like a healthy glow. I am feeling my eyes right now. I love the eyeliner. The eyeliner is a winner. Like what sold it for me, actually using the cosmetics, because you already know I love their glimmer, their, 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 their gold glimmer. But what sold it for me putting on the actual, they go together they actually go together but their products actually complement each other you would think oh with this look you want a little bit of a makeup but the little lip gloss actually goes with it the little highlights from the concealer it really goes together quite well so you know i'm pleasantly surprised it is a yay 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 i definitely will be using these products again i definitely will be putting them in my kit I will be going to Helen E's cosmetic website and I will be buying more of their products. I feel like they're a very good brand. I am presently surprised considering I spent £25 and I've spent hundreds and hundreds of pounds on a brand and I didn't like it instantly like this. Do you know what I mean? So cheap and cheerful on the day but those were the discounts on the day of the wedding show and yes they are very good for wedding makeup you can have this look on your wedding and it and it looks flawless to me so it gets a big thumbs up from marika yamazaki just know that your love and your order anybody needs mm -hmm. and i'll catch you honey bunnies yes you the ones that actually came i watched to the end honeys i'll catch you guys on another video Mwah. tell me Tell me, hey you. Tell me, hey you. Tell me, hey you. Tell me, are you throwing back? Are we really moving forward?